Anyways, uh, we went to Costco. We went yep. to Fred Meyer, but we're not showing you our Fred Meyer hole. We were um, like, I gotta use my dad joke. We were like Emerald Lagasse. We kicked it up a notch. I don't know. I was just hungry. We had breakfast for dinner, and everything we ate was seriously tan. Like, yeah, we had, we had hash browns. We had English muffins. We had chicken sausage. And, and eggs. Eggs. And everything was like, our plate was like, so then I think it like made me be like the rainbow at Costco today. Because I was like, we just were in the, the rainbow. in the veggies and produce and just tossing everything. I was like, you want this? You want that? You want this? And we got it. We got it. But I'm excited. You'll find out what we got. I'm always excited, apparently. And it's rain. it's been raining today. Shocker. Washington rain. And it's typical of January weather just, we have. I don't know, because we've had some nice days, so then it just made me feel like uh, I'm bored. When are you done with work? Come on, pay attention to me. <laughs> <laughs> and then the kids were building a fort and playing nicely. They were ignoring me. Jesse was ignoring me. So this is my attention I get today. Instagram was her friend today. Uh oh. So we got two things of um, raspberries. Sometimes I am like, ah, do I buy those? They're five dollars. But yes, you should buy them. Don't buy the chips buy the berries and they look good that's an order a direct order buy them now <laughs> envy apples um for all the cool kids and then we got mickey apples for the mickey mouse clubhouse kids don't do, do, you do, know do, 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 do. and then um more pears my nieces and nephews came over to our house i was watching them and they love pears, and so all the kids, like, ate the whole bag of pears. So I was like, well, better get more because they are a hit. Look at these strawberries. They just look so good. I've got to food prep them so then they don't go bad because it really actually, I think those storage containers do work. So two things of strawberries. What are your thoughts, Jesse? Do you think they work to keep them fresh? I think so. And then, you know, it makes you wash your food before you eat it, too. This. And then I wanted to make um, some little pizzas on these, I think, for the kids. Or, you know, I've been really wanting Greek food for some reason. So, like, we could do, like, a little Greek night. It does I've never good. had Greek food. I can't, eat, I can't eat these, but it sounds really But we good. could make you a gluten-free, dairy-free hoopla. And then um, Giselle was out of her OJ, her morning cup of OJ. Yep. So she had to get that. And then I just was like debating between getting juice boxes for like hikes or this lemonade. And I was like, we're trying to, even though you can't tell on this haul, save money like in little ways. And so I was like, well, this is, you know, $4 cheaper buy this if they really want juice we can pack a container in reusable cups plus we got some really good weather in the forecast so be something nice to have as a little afternoon drink yippers peppers <laughs> peppers ah. get it um i made jesse grab i was like grab those because i don't know if we still have mini hummus but that just sounds so good i'm hungry so right now anything sounds super delicious so and then again with the liquid IV, was it still on sale, Jesse? Uh, on sale for the next two days. So, so he was buying we'll a little it. bit more because he ordered me the special pair one that I showed you guys, but then he doesn't like it. So, and then they had cauliflower back in. Yay! Yay! Everybody cheers. I don't know what we're going to make with it. We have this really good honey cauliflower garlic. Like it's like a knockoff, like not knockoff, but like faux chicken. Yeah, it's supposed to be like a meatless style of like a just a honey, like a honey chicken chicken bite. But it, it's really good. It's really good. Like the kids even like it, so we're gonna probably make that. And then um, we actually bought two of these security lamps, light things. Uh, my dad asked us to pick us up him up some, so it actually works well because then you get to see it in the hall. They have other ones that are 
um, solar powered for the same price as these, and I thought that was pretty cool. And then they did have, you need an? You don't need an electrical hookup for the solar power nope, ones. The solar so, the panel it comes with is what charges. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. Pretty awesome. I've always wanted a home with like solar panels on it. Did you know that about me, Jesse? I believe it. It's my secret. Um, thing I wish for. Tesla wall, here we come. I don't even know what he's talking about. And um, Washington State Asparagus. Well, we've been getting fresh asparagus from the um, farm, stand. farm stand at our area we live. I almost told you where we live. Dun, dun, ah! dun. On the area where we live. But um, the little farm stand's closed right now. So, I mean, like asparagus season's over for them. So, but I would like to plant some one day. Ground turkey. Um, I love how it comes in the four packs and we eat it all. So we needed more of this. I don't know if we have any ground beef, but we do have sausage in the, um, where do we have sausage? Fridge. In the fridge. So I thought, well, we could make little mini meatballs this weekend and have it because Duke really likes those. Yep. And then, um, chicken, winner, winner, chicken dinner. We'll cook up two packs of this for the week for salads. It, it was really good this week in my salad. I never, I didn't have any of it. Oh, geez. See, I ate two oh packs God. of chicken with Duke. And then, um, plums. Hudson requested these. I wanted to smell them. Can you open them? Can you do it? Can you dig it? <laughs> They're not as, like, fruitful smelling. Like, <laughs> I'm, like, sniffing into the microphone. They just, you can't smell them. Smell I just want to bite it. Smell a vision. Uh, whatever. Here's the inside. They're not like as juicy as I remember plums. And then watermelon hard cider. I'm interested to try this. Well, a minute. Watermelon. <laughs> <laughs> You're trying to sing a song. Yeah. Epic fail. And then the kids needed more vitamin C um, things, things, uh, vitamins, more vitamin C vitamins. And then two things of bananas. Don't those bananas, they look so pretty right now with the white thing. Uh, trying some underwear. We'll see how they work. Yay me. They were only $6, so you really can't go wrong with that. And then some more um, workout sports bras. I really like these ones because they have the cross back option. And for running, awesome. I've already like ruined one of these that I just recently bought. So, and they were on a good, they were a good price. Uh, hand soap, we're out of hand soap almost at our house. So got to keep it clean. Yep. The kids go through it so fast. Part of it's because they're playing in it, but do we really care that they're using soap? They're I'm going to vote no. Like, they're use the soap, hands. children. Use this. Oh, it's scratch and sniff, Jesse. Hmm. Sorry, I was sniffing. <laughs> mm. I got a shot of your gray hair in that one. Uh -oh. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> and then, um... Take the Mediterranean the crunch chop salad. We they were out of the romaine little heads that the artisan yep. romaine heads artisan. that we likes. We that we likes. <laughs> we's a likesies. I'm crazy. We're hungry. That, the artisan romaine that we like. Oh, I hope you. I hope you laugh with me because what fun is it if no one's laughing with you? And um. So then I was like, let's just, we have a couple of the romaine heads left. And so let's just get a couple salad kits and that will get us through the rest of the week coming up. I mean, it's only Friday, but it will get us through the weekend and the week. Jesse got the sweet kale salad kit. Sweet kale. He's eating all that. Did you like that? No, yeah, it's pretty good. Was it as flavorful or I could have burnt my uh, tongue earlier. It need, I think if it was a little more ripe. Yeah. It would have that real juicy sweetness. but And then um, grape tomatoes. These, I want to make bruschetta soon. And my dad has basil growing. And so I'm going to have to steal some from his house. Not really. He'll give me some. But I just 
was saying steel. Cucumbers. Bada bing, bada boom. I'm just moving this stuff. Snap peas. These look really good. I don't know what's on the counter. What food is this? I swear, I cleaned today. Sugar snap peas. They look so crunchy and fresh. Do you see that? Like They do look crunchy. They do. They look like good ones. We got a good one. And then the baby carrots. Baby carrots. Is that what I was doing? Baby, baby. carrots. Baby. Um, baby. This baby. goes off, I think, on the 15th. The turkey sausage egg witch. Super delicious. And I was actually looking, because it's gluten-free and it only has dairy. I was interested to see what the egg part had in it, because... It contains milk, but I was thinking, oh, the milk is probably the cheese? Nope, the egg patty has whole milk in it. So I was wondering, oh, could we take the cheese off and Josie could eat it? But the answer is no, this has whole milk, which is kind of weird. And then um, this cooler bag, I've heard a couple people talking about it. And it was, um, I just signed up to try to be like an Instacart shopper. We'll see how that goes. And you need a cooler bag. So I was like, it was a great price. You can fit a ton in it. And I was like, well, let's try this. And you can like clean it out. So I can use my Clorox wipe to wipe it out after each guest. I don't know what it's called. Like client. Stay in my each client. Bag. <laughs> each client. <laughs> and then um, Northwest Organic 2% milk and silk. So... That is our haul. So that was our weekly Costco haul this week. Um, and the Instacart thing that I just mentioned, I always try weird, like new little jobs. I'm always doing something. I did, um, I've been selling on eBay for 10 years, over 10 years yeah. now. And I'm getting tired of having like all the extra product in our house. Like, it is exhausting to have to constantly shuffle. Like, I sell the kids' clothing when they're done wearing it. I donate stuff, too, of course. And then I sell family members' clothing. I've had, like, my post office person ask, oh, can you sell stuff for me? Everybody I mean, always... I we get stuff from the neighbor yeah, in our house, too. When people find out you sell stuff, they want you to sell their stuff because they're even just tired. And they'll try to treat you like a Goodwill, too. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm super appreciative of some people's stuff. And then other people's, like, some of their stuff, I'm like, just donate it. Like, yeah. just donate it. It's okay. It's good to donate. But, so I'm trying to find something to balance, like, okay, the kids need new school shoes. What can we do to make a little extra money to do that? And I know, I think a lot of people are going through this, like, trying to figure out ways to hustle. So, yep. <laughs> I'm a Her, hustler. She's my little hustler. <laughs> <laughs> I always have something going on but um thanks for watching and I want to get a hiking video out and I hope you guys enjoy it because that's really where like I love Costco shopping we always need food I love food yep. but like the hiking is like where we get to show like pretty places to people who don't get to go there sometimes and so if we put out a hiking video Tell us what you want to see. We'll go hike. Yeah, we'll go adventure wherever and uh, find things you guys want to, anything particular you want Waterfalls, to sell Waterfalls, lighthouses. Yeah. I mean. The, the ocean, we'll go out that way. We'll, Rainforest. Desert. We'll go Anyways. find a desert. Remember, always rise and shine.